Whenever you start an app or a game on an Android device, it takes space in system RAM. That's random access memory and shouldn't be confused with the internal storage. Now, a small game or app might take between 350 and 500 megabytes. A big game might take over a gigabyte and something like Chrome with multiple tabs open can even take up to two gigabytes. That means if you have a three gigabyte Android device, of course, any one of those apps can run without any problem. However, many people like to keep multiple apps in RAM at the same time so you can switch between them seamlessly. Now, when you start a new app, Android will search for some free RAM. If it can't find any, it will use techniques like ZRAM or swapping to free up some RAM. Ultimately, if it can't find any RAM, it will kill off an app from memory that you haven't been using recently. Now, according to my testing, if you're buying a budget phone, try to get one with at least six gigabytes. If you're going for a mid-range or a premium phone, make sure you go for eight gigabytes. 12 gigabytes is the most that you'll ever really need, and 16 gigabytes is really just about bragging rights.